past two days here at the Karlsruhe Institute for Technology, we've hosted the kickoff meeting for phase two of our DFG funded Promise project. On the first day, we had some really excellent technical presentations on the four individual uh, research projects within our unit. Those are evaporation, multiphase catalysis, photochemistry, and nanoparticle synthesis. At the end of day one, we had some really good discussions, including over a, a lovely dinner at a local restaurant. And day two, we tackled even further the challenging cross-disciplinary or cross-project topics, the interlinking topics. And these, for our particular project, are modeling and numerical simulation and model and sensor-based control and regulation. And as we go into phase two of our project, we'll be having even more intensified focus on these interlinking topics supported by some really particularly structured activities to enhance our collaboration across the four research projects. We are really fortunate in this project to have additional funding from the DFG, not just for the core scientific research, the modeling, the simulation, but also to address some of the other really important issues that go with scientific research, including how we develop and enhance the careers of the young scientists involved in this project, how we collaborate internationally on this research, and how we promote gender equality in the research that we do and the way that we work. And over the past two days, we had reports on the activities that have occurred in phase one uh, on these topics, but we had discussion and we planned what can we do in phase two to even further enhance these important aspects of our project. It's a very exciting research unit to be a part of. We're very grateful to the DFG for their funding and we are thrilled to be collaborating with our colleagues from Uni Freiburg and here in Karlsruhe Institute of Technology on this really exciting project. You can find out more information about the Promise Project from our webpage and we'll be communicating more of the outcomes over the next three years with short videos like this one.